because it's two feet on high, they don't know it. So oh. <laughs> <laughs> okay, welcome friends to the wedding ceremony of Kimberly Carol Akers and Brian Carter Asper. Take your hands as we prepare to say, well, I guess you won't be able to because you're going to be doing it. Brian, you're going to say the vows first. Okay. Have yours ready? Just one page back. <laughs> Tim, when we first met on that. <laughs> Sorry. I just knew there was something very special about you. Being with you felt so natural, so real, and so comforting. Time stood still. And then listen to you tell me more about your life. Your special job. <laughs> your passion. You also listened to me and gave me the time I needed to tell my story. We would have many more evenings to be together and let our bond forge naturally, like a leaf to a tree bird to a nest, a wave to an ocean, you and I just fit together so hard. I knew I was in love with you when you took such good care of me during my vertigo. You would just drop everything and pick me up and nurse me back to health. You cared so much and wanted to help me through this time. Here I was, a grown man, vulnerable and scared of what was happening to you. You cared about me so deeply and you were really concerned and at this time especially your heart. You were so reassuring to me and gave me courage to get I needed and surgery to fix it for once and all. It was after this that I just knew I needed to do it. Before I met you, I was existing on a very unsure path in my life. I'd just gone through quickly and I'm not the person. However, you never once touched me. You just encouraged me to keep moving forward. Can I credit you with saving my pay? Now I wake up every day. I can't wait to look into your eyes, hear your kiss, to embrace you, and I need to share this life with you. No matter what we do, watch TV, go for a bike ride, go on a trip, it's always perfect with you. Because of you, I see the world as glass half full and not half empty. Every day is a great adventure with you by my side. I never thought I would ever find someone like you. You loved me so deeply, you cared about me so. You care about me so much, you complete me, and you make me such a better person. And now as we take this final step of coming together before God and our closest friends, <laughs> um, uh, I want you to know that I promise to love, respect, and trust you, and give you the best of myself. For I know that together we will build a life far better than either of us could imagine love. Can I take you to be my wife? I will love you unconditionally and without hesitation, for it is your heart that moves me. The spirit that inspire me, inspires me, the humor that delights me, in your hand I want to hold for all of our days. I love you to the farthest stars and back, forever and always. Kim, you'll get ready to do that. Bye. I'm feeling a little intimidated. Yeah. <laughs> 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 I write newsletters for his job. I I write these great letters for first graders. There's going to be a lot of unicorns and rainbows. Okay. Oh, yeah, a lot of unicorns. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um, so Brian, you walked into my life unexpectedly. Um, and I walked into love with you with my eyes wide open, my heart wide open, and my arms wide open. I wanted to take every step along the way with you every day of my God-given life. Brian, my love for you is deep, deeper than I ever know. It's an indescribable feeling, kind of contentment, joy, passion, and hope. Hope for an unbelievable way. I just need your husband and wife. I believe in fate and destiny, and I believe it was fate that brought us together that one Friday night two years ago. And I thank God every day for that. Brian, I would choose you in a hundred lifetimes, in a one hundred worlds, and in one hundred versions of reality. 
I would always choose you as my friend, my husband, my lover, my soulmate over and over again. So today, with my ring, I give you my heart as well as my soul. I promise you to stay forward and always will never walk away. My heart will be your shelter and my friend will be your home. I love you to the moon and back where I am. Do we have some rings? We do. <laughs> Brian? Oh, uh, yeah. This oh, yeah. That's oh, one. One. Brian, you'll go first, and while placing the ring on Kim's finger, repeat after me. With this ring, I thee wed. And gladly join my life with yours. Gladly join my life with yours. Okay. Kim, take the ring. While placing it on Brian's finger, repeat after me. With this ring, I thee wed. And gladly join my life with yours. By the power vested in me by the state of Ohio, I now pronounce you man and wife. Friends, I introduce to you for the very first time Mr. and Mrs. Brian and Kim Asbury. Brian, you may kiss your bride. Woo! Yeah. All right. I just want to say a quick uh, wedding blessing. <laughs> Heavenly Father, we just thank you today for these two before us. Lord, we just ask that you would bless their marriage, Father. Just bless everything that they touch together. Father, just give them many, many years of happiness and success together. Father, just show them your love. And Father, we just ask that each one that's here in your presence would also support and do everything they can to support this marriage. And we thank you for all things. In Christ's name we pray. Amen. 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 Amen.